Hello Elites and welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies. This is episode 5 and in this episode we are back. And we are going to do some more... Ooh, evil. We're gonna do, we're gonna do some more levels and see how far we can get. We stop, we stop at the night time. Look, there's a screen door zombie and we have three plants from... Three plants from the nighttime level. So let's go ahead and figure out... We're gonna take these three and we're going to take that, the potato mine. The, um... Walnut and the uh, the repeater. Let's see if we can do with the repeater. Actually, no, 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 no. Snow pea, then repeater. We don't really need the walnut, do we? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. We need definitely these, right? Yeah. Okay. We probably won't even get to using the freaking um, what should I call it? The uh, repeater, but that's okay. So let's go ahead and do our usual thing. We plant the one sun shroom in the corner, then we plant a um. Uh, pup shroom anywhere in the front, uh, front, fourth column perhaps, or maybe sometimes third, sometimes fifth, uh, or the middle column that is at that point. Um, zombie coming zombie. from that. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Go ahead and double that up so we can kill him faster. It takes about ten hits. And, um, just keep building up our sun economy and then we will be good. Put that down and give me some of this. Put some of that. All right, where's the next zombie coming from? Down there. Okay. There's one sh uh, one pup shroom for you, and we'll wait for the next one to come around. Come on. Ah, uh, do it. Yes. Now another sun shroom, and we're almost done with the second column. Um. Then we can start building up our uh, our fume shrooms whenever we see the first. Um. First screen door zombie. And now my tip with Plants vs. Zombies, whether you're playing the first or the second game, whether it's, you know, the first game or two, it's about time. Um, always plant accordingly to the row difficulty. So, like, I won't just plant a sh uh, fume shroom anywhere, you know? I'm gonna wait until I see the first screen door. I'm like, oh, you know what? There we go. I have enough sun for us. So, you know, right now I did it because I have enough sun. So I, I, my economy's full. Um, soon the shrooms will grow, and uh, but early on, you want to save your sun up, just in case. You want to get yourself out of doo-doo, so that's going to get hard, out of nowhere, too. So you want to be prepared. Um, I don't have the Great Buster yet, I think he might be the next one I unlock him, so. Ooh, look, 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 boom, right there, put him down right away, so they will attack. And I don't care if that first one gets eaten or the second one, as long as that punch, or the fume gets eaten. Uh, we can go ahead and put down a second one if he gets a closer, but uh, I don't think he's gonna make it that far. Will he? I don't know. We'll just uh, keep planting anyway. And we'll make two columns of fume shrooms, even though we probably won't need it because there's only one flat to go. So it's gonna finish kind of quickly. Yeah. And uh, we'll put the fume shrooms where there's gonna be cone heads because I think I think damage from fume shrooms is a little bit stronger than they are from pup shrooms. I think. And they do shoot shoot farther though, or further. So they do shoot a little bit further back. So that's good. You can them further back. It's the puff shrooms that take a little bit of a short distance. So there we go. We got a P taking out that one. That's okay that he ate that one because that was a decoy. There we go. And now we can start planting peas. Um, I already have one down, but we can start planting some where we need some help. This is the final wave anyway, so it doesn't really matter. It's gonna go by real quick. Alright, come on. Where the zombies come from? Let's plant up where their graves are. So, right here. Oh, look at that. Conehead soup. Dang. That row's gonna need it too because that one has a conehead. That's not good. Alright, come on. Give me some sun. Do it. Do it. Somebody. Eh. Okay, well, they're dead anyway, so. Now we're gonna protect that top one. That top one will be a little bit closer. Okay, that guy's dead. And now for you. There we go. We won. Alright, we got the Grave Buster. Yan! Yan! So we got the Grave Buster. We can use him now, finally, and get some money. An extra sheet slot. $750? Sure, I will do it. How much do I have? Oh, I do have enough. Thank you so much, Crazy Dave. You are awesome. Thank you. Now I have eight seat slots. Let's do this. So we're gonna choose these four, obviously. I'm gonna choose another. Oh well, not eight. What am I talking about? Seven. I can't count. <laughs> seven. So uh, seven seats off. That's not bad. 
So let's do, let's see, let's, let's see, let's do this. We can use Cherry Bomb for the nice explosive ending and then the, the P. We always need a P. Not always, but you know, we need a P for the night time. Just for some extra firepower, because I feel like they're stronger than mushrooms, I'm not sure. I am really not sure. I have not studied the album enough. And I've played this game for a long time. When it first came out, I played it. And I always played it. And, uh, you know, I'm an expert at it. <laughs> but I just don't know the attack power, because I never really studied the almanac too much. I was like, I beat the game anyway, so what's the point? They really should give you the almanac in the beginning. Which, they do in the second game, which is good. Because you don't really need to wait to the end. You need it right away. So... Alright, he's dead, nice and easy. Now we can get rid of some of these graves, like the one right there in the middle. It's kind of annoying. It's messing up our symmetry. Alright. Going this way. Send shrooms. We're already done with our first column. We're good. It's nice and early on. Now we have two flags this time. So we actually have time to work on uh, our economy really well, and then work on our defense. Or what you call it? offense? I think our offense. Yeah, we're gonna work on our offense. Really well. so come on, let's get these guys out of the way. Okay, there's a uh, freaking cone head, and we do not have anything repaired yet. Okay, we need to hurry up and get. Oh gosh, I'm not ready yet. Uh, fume shroom, another uh, puff shroom. Come on, guys, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. His arms gonna pop off, and then his head, and done. Okay, good. All right, another one at the bottom. Get him. Go. And we're done with our sun shrooms. Now we can uh, save up for our fume shrooms. And go and place you down. And then we can also use our 75 sun on the grave buster for the grave. Now let's get that grave over there because it's kind of in the way. And we would like another puff shroom so we can kill that zombie faster. Because he died anyway, but you know, it'd be nice if he died one square behind that. You know? We've gotta kill him nice and early on or else they're gonna creep up to the house, and that's not good. Right, take that one out. Hopefully one of these gives me a diamond. I love when I get diamonds from, uh, from these grave busters. It's pretty fun. And hopefully these next four episodes I can get to the uh, pool level. Oh no! Ah, uh, he ate the freaking grave buster. I saw that. Stupid cone head. Alright, that's okay. We're gonna put the uh, finish one on top. Whenever we get the sun for that. And we will take you out. You little... Slut. There we go. Don't worry, he'll die fast enough. Yeah, go ahead and eat that shit. We've died anyway. Alright, now, over here. Yeah, these cone heads are being a little bit past here, eating our first growth. He's annoying. See, look at that. So we need to plant up our defense. Because the first flag is coming by. We're gonna get rid of the graves up front right now because there's no zombies. So no one will eat them again. That's kind of a waste of sun. We should have waited. Alright, stop you from freaking doing that because you're in the wood. Alright, we're good, we're good. Put it on there, replace that one. We got a lot of purple bubbles going across the screen, that's good. Alright, and now that. Let's go ahead and. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna take out another grave in a sec. Go. There's no zombies there, right? But I don't want to come out of the bush and start eating them. Oh, shoot. Ah. Good thing. Well, he would have made him jump over, so that was kind of a bad thing that he went away from us. Oh well. Right. And now we're gonna start planting grape here. Just to get that extra boost of uh, peas. So to knock out that row really quick. This is the last grave. And then. Aw, oh, no diamond. So we didn't get any diamonds from the uh, graves this time, which is. Eh, it's okay, but I love getting diamonds. Oh my god. That's good money. There we go. At least in the first game. In the second game, it's not very, it's not very monetary. It's not very monetary uh, to uh, like money. Units. It's more like just to buy plants if you want them, if they're premium. And they're not, they're not chargeable for money, yet, but they're chargeable in diamonds first. I don't know. I don't like the second game too much. I'm a fan of people. I do like the plants in the second game. That's pretty cool. Alright, a coin down there. Got it. We are almost done with this level. We're about to hit this flag soon. And hopefully I can get these last two repeaters down for some symmetry. So I can finish off like that. 
but, you know, these guys are being a little bit slow on their separate. There we go. Another one. Take that guy out before he even takes a bite. And the middle row is last. Stop eating. Come on. Ugh, I'm almost there. There we go. Alright, look at that symmetry. I know there's the little huge on the front on the top row, but... That's because I want to kill that, uh... Pole vaults are a little faster, but he died. Someone took like two bites. Alright, kill this guy. Let's replace some of these with huge. Because why not? It's just better to have a higher offense. Let's replace another one. Ooh, we should save up for the cherry bomb so we can blow him up. And just finish this off faster. Give me sun. Give me sun. Yes. Uh, it's kind of symmetry, not really. Well, we won without the cherry bomb anyway, so I guess we don't really need to bring it to the next level. So now we have the almanac, fine. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and play the next level. Black a zombie. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Let's play Wack a zombie. I love this minigame. Boop. Ah. Wait, how am I gonna hit him? Oh, it's X. Oh, dog. I kind of looked into the top right corner. <laughs> I cannot see. I'm looking at blind. Um, okay, this is pretty easy. Not bad. It's kind of hard because there's like a low sensitivity to the, uh, the speed of the cursor, but that's okay. Because, you know, with, with the phone, you can just tap anywhere real fast with rapid speed. But, like, this is just a little bit more challenging. I like it. Not bad. It's like you kind of want to keep your mallet towards the front just in case one comes around. But then if you need to go back there, just go back there. Or you can just wait till the, wait for them to come up front, which is uh, pretty nice too. But I like taking out the front graves, leaving off the back. I leave like this corner of uh, graves. I don't let them grow up top or grow too far. Because then they just, they're just they everywhere. And I bet you the game rewards you more by giving you more sun and more clean. Probably higher possibility of diamond if you let them go close to longhorn and then kill them. But I don't want to do that. Look, look at that. Freaking grave. Why do you grow right there? Why? You know what would be so messed up if it grew like two blocks away from the Like just like two away from the, the lawnmower. That would suck. Man, you'd have a high chance of losing a lawnmower if you didn't watch fast enough. And if it was like a bucket head too. Don't they have adaptations of this um, Wacko Zombie where they have like, if you purchase the uh, the premium levels or whatever, like with all, like 50,000 coins or 150,000 coins or something like that, like extra mini games? Don't they have a Wacko Zombie with like every other kind of zombie? Like, uh, like they probably, they probably add like football zombies, maybe like other crazy stuff. They should if they don't have that. I'm not sure because when I played the first game a long time ago, I never really unlocked all the extra mini games stuff like that because that's a lot. It really is. They have a lot of mini games to this, so I've seen people play them, but I have not played myself. So. I cannot wait to unlock that with you guys. I will uh, grind for money off camera uh, on the pole, and I will make that so I can purchase those, and then we'll just play those on camera. With it. I'm not gonna be the YouTuber who never cuts anything off. Look at this. We're getting bucket heads now. It's because we're at the end. That's why. Alright, so four braves. Oh, never mind. Five. Now what I like to do at the end is dig up the grave. So I like to kill all the fast, fast, fast ones. Keep the slowest one, let them go up front. So dig this up, do like that. Okay, dig up this grave. We're gonna kill him and then go back over there and uh... Oh no! No, I shouldn't have come back to that, but okay. Hypno Shroom. Anyways guys, that's it for this episode. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I hope you did. Subscribe today if you haven't already. Tell someone about the channel. I'll see you in the next video that I create. And so... This is a very fun episode. We got two plants, and we are going to continue with the nighttime levels. Goodbye, elites. Goodbye.